clubs across three group run races. Some greats of the turf were upstage while a rising sprint star extended her winning run. Champions Day at Flemington saw Zaki striving for a third straight win in the stakes. It took a heavyweight team to take him down. James McDonald and Chris Waller guiding a tissue to victory. It's a tissue. J-Mac again. A tissue wins. The man they call J-Mac adding the stakes to his derby and Oaks wins this week. This carnival's just it's second it. to none. The mile was made out to be a battle between longtime rivals Mr Brightside and Alligator Blood. But Pride of Jenny jumped out fast and never surrendered the lead. Pride of Jenny, this has been spectacular. I just love this mare so much. She gives her all. The mayor named in honour of Jenny Otterbray, the late daughter of owners Tony and Lynn. It's everything. You know, I'm, I'm a spiritual person, so I believe that Jenny was riding her, you know. Connections of imperatries cheered her all the way down the famous Flemington Strait. The Kiwi taking out the sprint, extending her winning streak to five races. She thinks in, she's a neck in front. Big money was up for grabs at Rose Hill too. Unspoken, sparkling in the $2 million five diamonds. Unspoken, the outside going to them. Unspoken! The youngsters of the track fought it out in the golden gift for two-year-olds. Short-priced favourite Shangri-La Express winning for Gay Waterhouse and Adrian Bott. All the makings of a, of a top-class two-year-old. Luke Dovesey, Nine News.